a welcome, welcome back, you guys. Welcome to a Shein accessory haul. Look, we got a lot of items, but we're gonna get into it piece by piece. Go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe. If you're looking for me to like do another haul with another company, just go ahead and message below where you think I should do another haul for them. Okay, I'm interested in shopping other places because I told you guys that I know that now my style has a change, it's just elevated. So I'm now looking and creating a closet that is evolutionary and not just like uh, like in a stage. Like I feel like every seven, 10 years, I'm gonna say five, seven years, I have to like keep revamping my closet and I want to make sure I got stable pieces, things that are um, evolutionary where I can wear at any given time and still be that girl but also I want to make sure that my my quantity of clothing is quality clothing all right all right so first of all let's go ahead and get into this haul if you don't know I have a Shein and Express clothing haul that we posted before this I'm gonna link that below so you can see that as well but first we're gonna get into the purses yeah yeah y'all hear it purses I didn't get that many um, I did buy a purse it was white it was dirty it was poorly made and it was so poorly made and they know that it was poorly made when i try to re refund it they said oh we're just gonna go ahead and get your money back don't worry about it you ain't gotta return it what when when we start doing that but neither here nor them all right so let's get into it we got this purse right here it is really really cute you guys also this come in multiple colors meaning this green part other purse can go in white and it's another color. I really got this purse because of the dynamic colors that it had. Also, it's a purse that you would probably really never see in a store like that. I like the purse chain. I like you can do like a short or you can do a long. Nice size, you should be able to fit everything you need. And the inside, it just has this little plastic thing. It doesn't have any slots that you can add it. It's just basically an open space. So just be mindful of that. But this purse is really, really cute. Really, really different. And I think you can take this, in my opinion, in different eras of your life, if that makes sense. You know what I mean? Well, let's get into the second purse, you guys. This purse, I was hoping it was going to come out real cute. I was like, Lord, please let this purse give what's supposed to give, okay? This is the purse. Now, I know y'all look like, y'all, it's just a plain purse. It is, and that's what I wanted, but I love the strap of the purse. You can do it like this. You can do it long. It can be a crossbody because the chain is so long. I like that it's very simple, very simple hardware, a brown purse with like silver hardware. I love the little clamp part. In the inside, it does have a zipper. So, but to me, this is one of those purses where you got to carry um, very light because of the shape of the purse. So, I'm pretty sure you don't want anything like really thick or chunky in it um, because it's going to make it look a little oblong or funny looking. But this purse is really, really cute, y'all. I love the chain. The chain has some weight on it. I was shocked. The chain has some weight on it and I like how the leather part is, is weaving in between the metal. It's definitely give a little bit more quality instead of just have like a little leather strap. It's giving somebody thought about something, okay? Somebody thought about something over there in the sheet in land. So that's the only two persons that I got. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go into the shades by itself. But we're gonna get into the one set and the color. It's like a brown, but it almost giving off like burgundy-ish. We're gonna put them on, cause y'all they fine. Oh, they fine. Yes. Yes, exactly what I was looking for. Something really, really cool. I'm kind of getting into where you can actually see your your like your actual eyes through sunglasses. I'm actually getting into them. At first, I didn't really like it. So I feel like that's the whole point sometimes of wearing sunglasses. You can be a little incognito. People can't really see your eyes. So when I wear these, I gotta make sure that I keep my eyes on point. Cause you know, I'm the friend. Sometimes my facial expression shows things, so I gotta make sure I keep my eyes and everything real, real cool, calm and collective when I wear these because my eyeballs sometimes be telling it all. Okay? But I really, really love the shape of them. They're almost, they are plastically, but they're not like, like, 
I said plasticky. They are plastic, but they're not a light plastic or a flimsy plastic. It got a little structure to them. It really has some structure to them. I really, really like these. So the next glasses I'm gonna show y'all came in a pack of five, all of them. So they have different packages of five, like different shades of glasses that you can actually get. So we're gonna go ahead and start off with these clear right here. Yes. Yes. Simple, you can throw them on, real cute. It's a little bit darker in the inside, which that's fine, but I love these. I got these sets of glasses because I feel like it was just given what it's supposed to give. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna buy a couple of more. I just want like a solid gold pair. Um, I'm in another pair that I'm trying to think what I'm gonna get, but I might spend a little bit of money on those. Uh, more than like, I think this set was like $5. I might spend a little money, like $20 for a pair, $12 for a pair. So this is the next pair. They all got like a cat eye-ish um, thing with it, but I love them. This one has a little print at the top. The other one's just a, like a little clear cream outline. This has a little print with that same tinted um, see-through glasses in the middle. All right, this is more of a tortoise situation with these thinner frames on the side. It's not as thick. They're actually lighter weight than the other ones. And they have the little gold tip right here. Love them. These are all like basic glasses that I just didn't have. Uh, and I was just trying to re-up. If you know, you know. Get some simple, cost effective. Yeah, look at these white ones. <laughs> I knew these white ones were gonna set it off for your girl. Listen, these white ones are giving everything. It's the same exact ones as these tortoise ones. It's just white and it had a little gold part at the end. That's it. Listen. Woo! I didn't know the white was gonna set it off like that, Boogie Boo Boo. We have them in black. Same thing. Like I told y'all, it's a set of five. So it's the same shape, just different shades. And some of them have the gold tip, some of them don't have the gold tip. Alright, and then they have a all black on black on black. Thicker size like these. It's given the same shape, the same type of siding with the little detail right here. It's the same thing, just in all black. And nothing wrong with all backpack glasses. And, okay. Okay, so that's the end of the glasses. Like I said, when I get some more, I'm pretty sure I'll probably get some really nice sturdy gold ones and probably another pair. When I get those, I'll probably get them from Amazon or somewhere else. I really want to try them on, y'all, because glasses is another thing. It's, like, funny. I want them to be sturdy. I want them to make sure that they don't leave no imprint. I want to make sure that they actually look good on the shape of my face. So, cause I mean, you could just return those for Shein. And if you can't, you're not losing nothing for $5. When you start going to like, you know, people wearing like designer sunglasses and stuff like that, I haven't gotten to that level because I am the person that lose things like that. So I'm not even gonna put my money into something like that. Not right now until I can get more, uh, I'm gonna say, uh, not say adultish, but more responsible when it comes to sunglasses, okay? All right. All right, y'all, so let's go ahead. We're gonna start into bracelets. It's this bracelet I bought, I bought in silver and gold. And I didn't like how the hard, you can actually see the hardware part where they like connecting both pieces of the bracelet. I don't like it. I can't return them, but I saw another um, YouTuber that's pretty big and she had it on. And I didn't like it on her either because I don't like this part. This is what I'm talking about. Y'all see it? This part is, it's giving cheap. It's giving Dollar Tree. And why would you do that? And the bracelet is so cute. I might have to get over it for real, for real, because oh, I just can't believe they did that. Y'all, it's so cute, dainty, just enough. I also got it in silver, but of course, but it's the same thing. It's heavy though. It's, it definitely got some weight on. There's not no little flimsy, um, I just don't like that part. The mechanical part of it is, I hate that. I hate that. I don't know if they had to do that because it was heavy 
or what but it's giving you got it from the dollar tree and there's nothing wrong with that but i like if i'm gonna get stuff for like cheap i like it to look a little bit more quality i don't want it to look like the price i paid for it if you know you know all right so we're gonna go into another bracelet right here this one it's gold and i don't know what this is um some type of like plastic marble cream and white thing intertwining if you guys can see it yeah this is real cute real dainty yeah also i have my wrist is actually a little bit smaller than others so you can actually mold it bring it down so it can fit your wrist so it won't slide off so it has to open it so all you gotta do you gotta really just push it towards and the inside and then just remold it to your hand and your wrist which i really love because it was really big and i was hoping i could do that next y'all just gonna go real fast real fast until i get to some more detailed pieces i wanted some uh, bracelets there's some more like basic bracelets so i got this gold set right here really simple like you get from like the ching ching not ching ching y'all beauty supply store beauty supply store right here and then i end up getting this silver set i like this silver set because i actually had these on yesterday i like the designs that they have on them and it just gives classic simple but like just enough details so when you stack it it looks really good on your wrist this is really good i really love this one all right So y'all, that is done and over with when it comes to the bracelets. We're gonna go ahead and get to the rings. I bought so many different like rings to go on my fingers. It's ridiculous, but I just needed some because I, I don't have that many. So I went ahead and uh, got some gold, silver. I was just doing a thing. I was just doing a thing. I was just doing a thing. So I feel like I'm missing some rings in this section I am. Alright, y'all, let's get into the ring section. So I bought these sets of rings. If you guys can see, they have different. This is just an all gold. It has a little gem. And these two have different colored gems in it. I bought this gold set. I just want to have some rings that's just not all gold and just all silver. Because I feel like it just gives a little bit more character. And I'm gonna show y'all a set that I bought that gives big character. Shop that they even had it. But you know, she ain't trying to come up with the come up. And I ain't mad at it. I'm trying to put all of them on. This is not all of them is that. But look at these. It's got like that opal gem situation. I love these. And I like how they're, they are big in different shapes. It came in a, a pack of mini. So I'm about to show y'all all of them that came in there. It's just so... I just love how they had the big pieces and the color of so here goes some more you see how this 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 piece right here this piece is real dainty with just a little of that gem right there this is another design and then this is another design they all have different designs which I love which I love big time all right, so I'm just gonna sit up here and showcase a few of my gold rings that I like in my selection. I have plenty more here, but they just like solid gold ones. Um, so we're gonna start with this hand. I really, really love this one. It doesn't fit, but I really, really love the shape. This one right here, this one. This one on my thumb matches the same shape as that bracelet. Ugh, and that's why I got the bracelet, because it matches, if you guys can see. All right, so on this hand, we got the dainty hand. So this is really, really cute. Um, this is almost like a rope ring. I love this because I haven't seen anything like this before. This is just a simple ring with a little gold tip. This right here, sorry, I'm not, I'm not um, sticking y'all up, okay? I'm not. This one is like, let me just take it off to show y'all. This is like a gold flower ring. It is so pretty and dainty. And then we also have this one right here. All the other ones are just like regular round gold ones, like different sizes. Uh, some are small, big, 
with wise so I'm not gonna show you those because they just simple I'm gonna show you one more set and these are a little bit different because I was like I want something that can do like neutrals I don't have to always do like gold and silver so I purchased this set of rings because it gave me that variety of having some rings that per se is not gold silver any of that if that makes sense because everything just can't be gold and silver now you know what I mean you you know need a little variety need a little variety so I'm talking to y'all I'm really putting them on my finger right now but I just felt like they, it was just so different and I needed it and I liked it okay so we're gonna start with this hand this is almost like that gold but this is just a pearl ring love this this right here is just a brown little ring and these are beaded rings one of them have like a little pearl right here this is a two set right here all these rings came in the same pack let me just say that um also these two you see they're not white they're like I don't know what they are but these are two separate rings and then this ring right here is brown with these little white spots on it I got these because just something you just want to throw on without having to go in the silver Cause you know people be going to silver now just to have a little variety when i need to choose whenever i need to choose all right y'all so we about to go into the eerie section it is a little extensive so we're gonna try to go ahead and wrap it up but i'm gonna show y'all how it looks on my earrings actually not earrings actually on my ears so that y'all can see what it looks like i will let y'all know about like density quality weight if they heavy light i'm gonna give you all that jazz Listen, y'all, before we go ahead and get started with these earrings, because there's so many, I will not be putting the website links. I will actually put the SQU, I call them SKU codes, that she and put for every single item below. And I'm going to place them in order, uh, the in order that I put in, in the video. So I'll make sure that I put, you know, one, two, three, four to let you guys know. Cause I do have several silver pairs of earrings. So I may go ahead and put like um a distinct name to it so that y'all can kind of know where it is so y'all can get the right SKU code. Because if I put all those in the bottom, that description box is gonna look so Bad. and I don't want that so I'm gonna put skew code now all right y'all let's get into the earrings so this earring is gonna be a silver earring as you guys can see it's just like an oblong shape very cute you can wear the work on date night anywhere this is a anywhere anytime type of earring it does have a little weight on it so if you have like scratched out um, earlobes I would probably say don't get these um but if you don't it's a little got a little weight just a little weight but they are so pretty as you can see they're very dainty and pretty also we're gonna go to this side of the ear it's gonna be a gold earring hoop i just like how they actually created this you see how it got a little dip when you put your ear in i just love how dainty this is it is very light at the top but this bottom part is got a little weight on it so if you do have a scratch out earlobe i would say you can still get these but just be mindful they're not as light as you think they are this part right here is like pure metal it has a little weight this part is very light this is where the weight come from at the bottom just fyi but these are right here very cute very light both earrings got a little weight on it these just have a little bit more weight and i like how they stand out see how these stand out with my hair love it you can still see your earring with your hair out you have a you know wig whatever you do you got braids it's gonna still stand out and show out in your outfit and through your hair these is a little bit more daintier as you guys can see but still they showing out mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. all right so we have these gold ones right here very pretty big statement earrings and then we have the silver ones right here we're gonna start off with the silver ones it is a different type of look you see how it's not connected really cute earring very cute earring very light earring okay now y'all already know this one got a little weight on it it's not as heavy as that silver earring but it still got a little weight on it but it's not as heavy as the silver one that I just had um, previously but these are really really cute statement earrings yeah love them 
Love both of them. This is very um, dainty. You can wear it to work. You can wear it anywhere. This earring, you know, when you really want to show out. And if you have that type of profession and you're comfortable and you feel like this professional, this is actually a really cute earring, to be honest. So you can really wear this to work if you're in that type of space and you feel comfortable wearing this type of earring. All right, y'all, let's get into these earrings. Both earrings got some weight on them, okay? So these right here, very cute, multi-colors. And then this one is just a clear earring that's chunky. Love it. Love both of them, y'all. This earring, because it's clear, you wouldn't think that it would be so bold, but this is a very bold earring, a subtle bold earring. This is definitely bold all the way through, okay? Both of them got some weight on it. I will suggest making sure you have the right back pieces. Ooh, hold on, y'all. Hold on, y'all. I fall out. Okay, make sure you have the right back pieces for heavy earrings to be able to support it so it won't be pulling so much and give it more um, leverage and balance on your ear. It's very important like these, if you can see them, they have a little bit more coverage in the back. Make sure you get the right back pieces. You can order them from Amazon. I link a few um, below that you can order to help with earrings. They have a little bit more weight too, so it won't be so heavy and give more balance on your ear so it won't pull it down, FYI. So we're gonna go ahead and get to some more. I told y'all we had quite a few earrings. Cause I won't play it. Y'all, this earring, I'm really just gonna show y'all because I actually bought it in black and in white. So this earring right here, as you guys can see, and we also have it in black. I thought these were really, really cute. They look like they're light, so I'm gonna try one on. Cause you know I like to give options. Yeah. Oh yeah. Y'all see that? They're light. Now these are light. You can definitely get these. I got, like I said, I got them in black and white. Very cute. Just enough pizzazz, just enough um, extraness, but still giving dainty, if that makes sense. I like getting things that I wouldn't norm not normally get. I like getting things that I don't see in the store or I don't see on other sites now. And things that I feel like is just a little bit, you know, different. I haven't seen on other women, to be honest. So, that's why a lot of my earrings may look a little different or like, oh, I never seen them on Shein. Y'all have to really look on Shein because when you click on the earring or any clothing item, go down to the bottom, it'll start showing you different stuff. And I notice when I click on things that I wouldn't normally get, I start seeing other like earrings and clothes and purses that I would never have seen because they kind of show you the same things because that's what you normally buy. So they're going to keep showing you what you normally buy that you have purchased from them or that you normally go and click on because they can see all that, they can track all that. So just a reminder, they're gonna show you what they think you wanna buy based on what you previously looked for, you previously purchased. So I always click on like stuff I know I would never wear, but you go to the bottom, it'll start showing you other things that you be like, oh, I really like that. This may not be so outside your box, but you might still be interested in. Just try that out, just try that out. All right, this is the battle of the silvers. We have this beauty right here, and then we have this beauty right here. Let's get into both of them. They have this in gold as well. It's just a very printed out, dented piece of silver. It's really pretty, really different. Um, these are not light, but they're not heavy. They like medium, medium, medium weight, medium weight, if that's, if that's a thing, medium weight. Get this, all right? These earrings right here, the same thing. I'm gonna take it off this board. Very cute, very oblong. I like oblong, different type shape earrings, as you can see, because it's give it more, um, more, I like to, when I go out and when I present myself, I want me to feel like, I just don't want my outfit to be fly. I don't want my hair just to be fly. I want my earrings, I want my purse. I want to look good from head to toe. So not wearing boring earrings and having a little personality is so me. Now, if you like boring, do your thing, stick to what you do. But for me, I've done that 
got that in my closet right now, so I don't really need it. So when I want to do boring or basically like some hoops, got that. But when I don't, I need to be able to put it on. I need to be able to put it on. Ooh, both earrings, like I said, it's medium. Got a little weight. Got a little weight. Not too much though. But I like a lot of things I learned, like when she in a lot of the silver earrings or earrings made out of metal. Sometimes to me last longer than like that plastic stuff. But that's just my opinion from my experience. Alright, y'all. We have three. Alright, y'all, we got three more pieces of earrings to go. So I got these earrings right here. If you guys can't see them, it's so much bright light. Now when I saw it on Shein, they looked bigger than this. And when I got it, I was like, I was feeling some type of way about it. But then I was like, well, Tanisha, you can do some things with these. And I had to start thinking outside the box, and I didn't send them back. But these are very cute, very dainty, a little bit on the odd side for me. May not be for you, but these are cute. They're light. They are very light, but they're cute. Very dainty. Definitely can wear them to work. So then I end up going a little neon, which I don't have any neon earrings. So I found these. They are very cute. Very cute. Very bright earrings. But I like them because I don't have anything like this in my in my closet. And the color is fire. So here they go. Light earrings as well. And they're not as big. I know some people don't prefer like large earrings or can't take it. These are medium size for me and they're lightweight. This pair as well as this pair right here. All right, y'all. So I'm, I'm on she in. <laughs> And guess what popped up? Them little Bottega dupes that everybody was buying from Amazon. And the reason why you missing the pair because I already wore the black was to work. <laughs> In that order. In that order. So you got the black, silver, and gold. I'm pretty sure it was like less than $3 for this pack. So we just gonna try a pair on. All right, they're very light. These are the smaller ones. These are not the larger ones. I don't know if they even have the larger ones. But look at that. Very dainty, very cute. You can wear it every day, wear them to work, business meetings, all that jazz. Very cute. I like them. I like them. I like them. I'm like them. So the earrings, I actually done it over with, but we're going to talk about this piece right here. This is supposed to be a piece of arm candy. Y'all see my arm, and you see this. Now you know that ain't going to fit. <laughs> It ain't going to fit. <laughs> That's fine. Because we're going to wear it as a bracelet. Uh, uh, okay, I'm glad you know. But we don't waste nothing around here, baby. So we're just going to put it on this wrist. We're going to close it in. Because it's like metal. Yeah. And we got us a cute. And it, and it fly. Bracelet. But it was supposed to be an arm candy. Like arm jewelry. Baby, it wasn't going to fit on my arm. I was like, and that was fine. That was fine. Because, baby, I'm going to make some out of it. And I couldn't return it anyway. So... Even though when I saw it, I wasn't going to return it because I knew it was going to do a bracelet, but I still just double check just in case. But look, look at here. Who arm um, this going to be on before a child? Like she in? Like she in? Come on. You, you, you be my girl sometimes, but sometimes, you know. All right, y'all. I got to show y'all one more thing. I know the video is videoing. I know. But I did get these shoes. I know somebody might say they might be a Hermes dupe. Actually, I didn't even know nothing about it until I saw it on a YouTube video. And then I saw a girl with the same print. So, oh, it's giving that. But I got them because I just like them. Y'all know jean, jean material, everything, purses. is like the thing, okay? But I got them because I don't have any jean sandals. So here they are. They are very cute. They have different shades of jean material, like lighter color, like lighter washes. I just got these. I got these in the eight because usually on um, she in, I'm a true seven and a half. So on um, she in, I gotta get an eight. Also, these, the bottom, this sole, y'all see, 
it's thicker than any other sandal I got from Shein. I don't buy heels from Shein. And I only bought sandals for Shein one time. And I'm not for sure if I'm gonna buy some more for them because the sole is so thin. If you live in a hot city, in a hot town, maybe that heat gonna be coming through them soles and hitting that foot. So I was very shocked to see that this, you might say, oh, that little thin. No, baby, this is thick compared to the sandals that they normally send out with them soles. So I am on the hunt for some sandals for the summer. So I'll let y'all know when I find me some good ones. I want some good quality ones. Um, and I need some for like traveling. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Like walking around resorts and stuff like that. I gotta find me some. That's gonna be next. But in the meantime, between time, these fit really good. They fit my feet perfectly. I think I got a little bit of room. I probably could have gotten a seven and a half, but I ain't want to play around with it. I'd rather have a little bit of room than your my back of my foot hanging off. If you know, you know. So, so what I'm gonna do, I know this was a lot. This was a lot. It's a lot going on. What I'm gonna do. I'm not going to actually put the links. I'm going to put the SKU codes for every single item based on how I did them in the video. Because I do have quite a few silver earrings. So I'm going to place the SKU codes based on how I put them. I warm in the video. So just FYI. Because I feel like if I put these links, it's going to be too many links. It's going to just look bad in the description box. 